Hey guys, it's Blake, and today I'm going to be showing you how to make an acorn design that I made by myself, inspired by my sister's PJ charm. <laughs> so first, we're going to get started, so we're going to get two brown bands going there to there. I mean, my sister's hook and stuff that I meant to. And then he's going to keep on going two to two there. Two bands. Push them all down. Then you're going to get two more brownies. And then you're going to put it there to there. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. It was flying off and hit me in the face. <laughs> hit me in the face. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. Now I'm gonna get another two. <laughs> Stop. And then go two more. There, there, there. You just up it. I didn't do that perfectly. Right. You go there to there. <coughs> now for the extensions. Shut up. Now we're going to get two bombs. <laughs> And wrap it around. One, two, <laughs> three, like that. <coughs> so I should do four loops. Now we go. Wait. There's another one. Now we have to do another one. So. Mm -hmm. So now we're going to get two more bandies. <gasps> Push them all down and wrap it around three times. One, two, three. That should make four loops. Now I'm gonna turn every loom around the other way. Get a hook and be ready to start looping. So first we're going to go under all these cap bands and grab the first two, holding down the cap band so it doesn't come undone. And that's the first one looped. Same with this side. Go under these cap bands, grab the first two, and do that. That's the second one looped. For the first one, just go ahead and take the first one off you did and hold on to that so it doesn't fling off. Make sure you hold on to it by taking it off so that's what it should look like and you take it off. Yeah, that's good. So, now we're going to place that piece <coughs> of thingy on the side of this thing. So, like, we're going to put this down, twist this around the right way, and put it on. Twist the bands on the side like that. That's the first extension. <coughs> now we're going to do it for the other side as well. So take the extension off. Hold on. Put it to it. And then you <coughs> just going to put it on the extension part again. And that's what it should look like. Stretch it out a bit if you have to. So that's the extensions. So now we're going to keep on going in our brown bit. So you just going to get the middle. Go on. Let's do that. Two more brown. Go down in the middle again. Make sure you push them all down for the best koali acorn you can possibly get. Let's keep on going until. <coughs> oh. I say stop. So, yeah, you're going to look like this right now. If it's not, then you should redo the steps that I said. And do one more middle. Uh, get some more brown for me. And do another one. And then we're just going to put it in like that. Now he lost me the one. So you're going to just put this one like that. So then you got to put the sides into the middle. So I'm gonna get a more brown. Push the mold down for the best quality acorn. Mm -hmm. Side to the middle. Middle to the side, I mean. 
push it down again for the best kawaii. Go from the middle to the top. <coughs> and just see it stuck up like that. Now for the capping beard right there. So we're going to get one. The more loops you do, oops, sorry, the light turned off. The more loops you do, the more it will come out like an acorn. So I'm going to do about five or three. So I'll think I'll just do five because acorns are pretty sharp. So you put one, two, three, four. That'll do. Okay, that's five loops. Now for the cap bands. So we're going to get triangle there. Triangle there. And that's all the cap bands you need. So let's get looping. Go under these bands until you grab the first two that comes out at you. Oops. <laughs> I think I'm a bit. So you grab the first two that comes out at you. I just snapped on the band, so that will just be fine. So it will still work either way. So. I snapped another one, but that's okay. Just because you did the captain band so tight, it will snap. But I'll try the last one <laughs> of this pack. And if you do this, it'll probably be the same. And uh, that snapped too. I know where to fix that though. So yeah, it's good. It's breaking too. Well, um, <laughs> what you're gonna do? Just put that one there and just grab it. Put it through the here. If this does happen to you, put it on the hook and pull it too. Oh. May take a bit of time to get it, but it's totally worth it in the end. Oh. I also stopped that one from earning from the help. I stopped that. Oh. <coughs> well, um, I can just grab this one and just, yeah, I can just try to do this, I guess, and see what happens. Sorry, I'm gonna put it down. Okay, now I'll do the cabin band again since I've tapped it up. This time I'm gonna do it two times to make it easier. Um, two. Okay, now. Since I still have one band on each, though, so. I should make three loops, and then you're gonna grab the first band that's on top and just pull it through. See? I hooked that easily. Yeah. Grab the first two. This should be the middle ones. Yep, I was right. Now the last band, which I stacked again, so there's only one. You, you have to do two for this, and just do the captain band as many times as you want. So it should look like a star. Then I'm just going to keep on doing the middle. Until we reached... The last one from the middle. So I'm gonna do this one more time. And now we're gonna do the side. Now, for this last hooking one, you're gonna push all these ones down. Just put it on so you won't come undone. 
And then just going to grab this. Hopefully this burnt snap. You have to be kind and gentle with it. So now for the other side, which is just pretty easy, I assume, for some beginners. So, yeah, <coughs> now I have to do the middle one again. If this snaps, it's fine. Oh, I didn't snap it. Now for the last one with the hooking process. This one. So, put it on top. And that's what it should look like when you're done hooking it all. So now you're going to get one band any kind of you want. And you're just going to put it through all these bands right here and just try slip knot it so he's gonna twist it and pull it through and try to do it as much as you can until you get it through almost got it then Got it. So when you get it, put it on your hook, put the back one in front of the front other one, and just pull. Until it makes it not done, pull too hot or it will snap. So when you're done, just, I take the sides off first to make it easier. Take all the sides off. Now you just pull the middle off and you're done all the sides. Don't pull too hard because then it's going to all come apart and you're going to be so sad. And this is what your acorn should look like. Let me just get a better view of that. One second. So this is what your um, acorn should look like. Do you want any suggestions how to make it better? Please contact me. Thanks for watching. Bye.